Hey, what's up, Falcons fans? I am DJ Shockley. We appreciate you guys joining us every week for Falcons Film Review, powered by Microsoft Surface. Big win on the road versus the Saints. Let's talk about some of the key plays in this ball game, and let's start on the defensive side of the ball. Each week, I keep talking about Dean P's adding more to this defense and making it look even more intricate. Let's talk about one of these key blitz looks that gets home right here. Now, Foyer is sitting right here. He's the guy who's going to end up getting home and getting the pressure on the quarterback, Trevor Simeon. But the thing I want you to watch here is Falcons are in what I call one robber or man free where you have a safety in the middle of the field and everybody else is playing man coverage, man coverage, man coverage on the outside, man coverage. But also, here's another thing. You know Alvin Kamara is a big part of what they do. So what they're going to swing him out here. What you're going to end up getting is the defensive end, Fowler here. He's going to bail on him. And then you're going to get Deion Jones here, who's also looking like he's going to blitz, but he's also going to bail. But also, on the other side, all these guys are here going to work this way. They're working this way to give Foyer a way to get through here. So as the play gets started, watch everybody push. Look at all these guys pushing. Remember, this is Grady Jarrett. He's outside in the nine technique. He's usually on the inside, but now you got him on the outside pressing from the corner. All these guys are crossing face, crossing face, forcing the line to slide this way, and then it creates a huge lane for you to run through for Foyer. Now look at everybody bailing out here, making sure you got eyes on Kamara, eyes on Kamara. Then you got man coverage, man coverage, free safety in the middle of the field. Now you got a free runner here to hit the quarterback, and he has to let it go before he wants to. I'm going to show you exactly what I mean from the back angle about these guys pushing one way, which gives him an opportunity to get home. Now here's the, here's the front one I talked about. Here's Dion. He's going to go out. He's going to make sure that we got eyes on him. We got eyes on Kamara here. All these guys are going to cross face, cross face. That's forcing these line to push each guy pushing this way, pushing this way. And then you're going to see a huge lane for him to run through here. Push through. Boom. Look at all these guys cross face here, forcing this guard to go here. He cross face here. Now you have a huge lane for Foyer to run through. And now you see the instant pressure. And now the ball has to come out before he wants to. And it ends up being an incomplete pass. Great job of setting it up. Great job of the skies and a great job of each guy doing their job to make sure they get home so the Saints could not get home and have a completion on that for play. All right, let's jump on the offensive side of the ball where the Saints tried to do something similar to what the Falcons did with bring some pressure, but also play a different covers behind it to try to disguise. Now, this is third and six here, and this is the catch here by Kyle Pitts. Kyle Pitts is on the inside of this slot here. I'm going to show you the route combination you have here. You got a shallow cross coming right here by Gage. You're going to have another shallow cross comes across right here, but then you also get this route right here. Now, the zone blitz means they're going to blitz guys off the edge. But they're also going to bail these two linebackers. These bail going to come out. And on the back end, you got cover two, cover two, cover two. So you got eyes looking at the quarterback, but you also have the look of a blitz. So that is a zone blitz from the Saints. But what happens here is the guy that has to cover Kyle Pitts on this out route is this backside linebacker. They're forcing him to push all the way over here. And this is where trying to disguise for too long gets you in trouble because he's so far away he can't get to Pitts here. Here comes the blitz off the edge. There's the pit. There's the blitz off the edge. Got two nickel blitzes coming off the edge. Here's your two linebackers. He's trying to close space here. But here is the backside linebacker that's going to try to get all the way over here to Pitts running this out route. And because he's so far away, look at this. He's so far inside. There's no way he can reach Pitts as he's running away. But a nice job of outside release here, which forces this corner to come outside. Now you have a huge void to throw this football into. And it's an easy completion on third down and six. And you see it, boom. Nice job here of completing it. But here's the other job I want you to pay attention to. Because they try to disguise and bring it, they bring five, but watch the offensive line. Watch the tackle right here, Jake Matthews. They try to push him to this guy and force two guys to come off the edge. But watch him come off at the end. Boom. Come off right there. Now you got it all picked up. Five on five. And now if you want to work this shallow cross coming across, he's open. You can throw this one if he's open. But knowing you have inside leverage here from this backer, it's an easy pitch and catch. And the Falcons complete it, third and six. And this is why the Falcons were really good on third down for creating plays like this and knowing where to go with the football. And once again, all 11 guys doing their job to make sure things go in the right direction. All right, I want to thank you guys for joining me. I'm DJ Shockley. This has been Falcons Film Review, powered by Microsoft Surface. See you next week.